Man, what's up? It's your boy MB here, man. And this is probably might be the last video I'll make on this topic. Maybe not. I don't know. Because I'm going to change things. But I wanted to make this video like I did with another another brand that I wholeheartedly stand behind. Because of the eight, I wholeheartedly stand behind them. And this brand here as well. This, to me, is one of the best setups I've had in this truck. This woofer, for the amount of output you get, the tonal quality and the deriferation between each note is exceptional. It sounds good as it gets loud. I love the surround. I, most, most of the woofers that I, that I feel truly excel have this, have some kind of tall, narrow surround. They never do the big fat. They have cone there. You always see the cone, the dust cap, and you see me cone. The carbon fiber dust cap, the cup fiber cone mix, their own mix uh, that they use, and they have mass produced for them. The basket, the seven and a half inch cutout, the depth to the basket, the motor size, for 2023, he set a bar that needs to be surpassed. I don't know how manufacturers are going to do it. I advise you, if you watch my channel, you secretly subscribe, subscribe some other kind of way, you're going to have to buy this up with. And you're going to have to hear it. You're going to have to be objective. You're going to have to put it in 1.4, 1.5, your box, and tune it to whatever frequency you want to tune it to. And it's going to show you something. It's that great of a performer. And I just had to part ways. I mean, when I've been closing on this, on this subwoofer, it's too, too much more I can do with it. Now we're going to do testing in smaller boxes. Because I'm going to take this size box out, the three cube, and do the testing with most of them now, 1.25 per which is something he can play in. He can play in one, he can play one half, he can play 1.25. He can do the same thing as another subwoofer that I like. The exact, he can, it doesn't matter. The bigger the box though, the bigger it is, the more output you're gonna get. Less power you want to use to get a, a certain goal. And I just had, I just wanted, I'm sure y'all know the other setup. There's two other setups that to me are just, y'all like gonna argue that in the comments. What is he talking about? I uh, may, some of you might get all three right. If you can pick the three best setups that NBE like, and I see in the comments, just keep reading the comments. Y'all watch this video and, and see what happens. But I want to see who can pick the, my three, my top three. It ain't got to be in a particular order. Just name the top three setups that NBE truly, truly likes. And this is one of them. There's two more. Mm -hmm. And I and if you watch the video in the comments, you'll be able to list them and say, "Hey man, it's this, it's this, it's this. This NBA's top three that he love above all others." Uh, you get these, you get these here. You gonna have some, especially if you got a truck set up. But anyway, peace. Get at me, man. You need box four four six nine four four eight one eight. And as always, please listen responsibly. Don't trip on it. Don't trip now. Y'all see me with my personality, right? My, my, my son bought my per my son bought me his personality. So, you know, I got I got I got to be pop for him. <laughs> Peace.